Okay, so we are here at the Foot Whisperer Reflexology Institute doing a hand routine demo for everybody, and this is also going to be up on our YouTube channel, so check it out once we post it. But for the hands, instead of doing solar plexus and adrenal to start with, which are the two reflexes we start on the ears, face, and foot, we're just going to go straight into the hot towels. So let's get started. As I leave the camera. Okay. So we take our dry towel. We're going to open it up. Take it nice and flat. And we're going to take our hot towel open it up, make sure that it's not scalding. These are actually pretty good temperature. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Kevin, for making this perfect temperature. We're going to wrap the hand curl underneath and then just burrito it and press. And do the same thing on the other side. And we have a separate video to show you how to do the hot towels on the hands because we're thorough like that. Open it up, keep it folded in half, on top, curl under, wrap and press. Okay, returning to the other side, press. For those of you that are averse to pressing, the reason why we do it is just to make sure that all of that heat gets into the hand. Press again once we unwrap. Are you ready for this? Throw it at Kevin. <laughs> Caught, it. Caught it like a pro. You can tell that's not the first time that I've thrown a towel at him. <laughs> Okay, and then we just dry off the hand with the dry section of that dry towel. Same thing on their side. Press. Unwrap. Press. Cody, dry towel on top, just dabbing dry, and the hands stay exposed. So as opposed to the feet which we wrap, the hands don't really need that much warmth. They're pretty circulated already. Okay. And then maybe a little bit of cream if you'd like, but the hands normally don't need that much, too much on the hands. Can cause a lot of slippage. We're going to start with our figure eight relaxation technique. Move on to breaking chocolate, pressing down with the thumbs and then pulling out from underneath with the fingers three times on each metacarpal. Flip the thumb up and military train on the hand. Yeah, if you guys need to see, go for it. And then we are going to do a nice wrist rotation. Starting with the dorsal surface, we're going to do two valleys, thumb and index finger, in between second, third, third and fourth, fourth and fifth. One thumb in front of the other, press, cross fiber. Pretty old mumble it back there. Clarification on the breaking chocolate. Breaking chocolate. Uh, should be on, on the bone the whole time. <laughs> on the bone the whole time for breaking chocolate. Okay. 
we plan on bringing the whole man. <laughs> <laughs> that is not an approved foot whisperer, Brennan. Right. Said, Breaking hands is not part of the routine. <laughs> I taught at uh, Cortiva, and during the hand routine, they, they were fascinated with the name breaking chocolate. They were like, we're going to break some chocolate, and then we're going to have some wine. <laughs> we progressed to tequila shots. It was wow. a very interesting class. Sounds, sounds like fun. Maybe one more for good measure. What's the next session? <laughs> After our dorsal valleys, then we do a figure eight to transition. And we start our fingers. Fingers. Fifth digit, trigger grip. Five squeezes. One, two, three, four, five. Three times. Rotate. So that we hit that medial lateral, five squeezes three times. Same thing each digit. You're not really pulling at all, right, Sam? It's just the pressure. Squeezing. More. Yes. The problem with pulling the fingers and the toes is that the fingers and toes are sensory organs, like that's their function, is to make sure that like we don't drop stuff and that we don't trip over stuff, like that's their role. So if we are too aggressive with them, the nervous system actually shuts down. Immediately, five squeezes. Switch hands. And then thumb. Switch. Fingers, figure eight to transition. Then flip up to the Palmer surface. Take a little bit of cream if you'd like and gloss. Then we are going to address the thenar area first in three sections, three times each. Thumb walking backwards. Switch hands, and then we're going to walk up each of the flexor tendons three times. Oops. 
obsessed with circles today. Shh, George, we're live. <laughs> <laughs> Also adding hypothenar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Flip the hand back over and figure eight. Huh? Yeah. Dogs are gonna do what dogs are gonna do. It's okay. <laughs> it barks in the background. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Back to the dorsal surface. <laughs> if you only knew out in Facebook land and YouTube land what they're doing behind my back right now. <laughs> Last valley. And that is the walking part of the routine. We finish with the relaxation techniques and then we're going to switch sides. Start with figure eight, breaking chocolate, thumbs together, pull up and out. Orient the thumb up, lock the wrist, and military train. Lock the thumbs, grab below the styloid processes, and wrist rotation. And now, bear with us as we switch our camera angle. Somebody want to take this from me and put her over there? Perfect. Go for it, go for it, go for it. Fabulous. With the help of our assistant, Jean. Golf club, golf club. Golf club. Y'all are ridiculous. Okay. Just trying to be supportive. Just trying to be supportive. Yeah. Yeah, no. As long as we don't drop it like last time. Okay, we good? Perfect, that's a good angle. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. This hand is much stiffer. <laughs> what? Looks like a little girl standing like on the ground. Like a munchkin. <laughs> Giant, <Thanks. laughs> Giant Sam and little Kayla. And Cody's making hand puppets. <laughs> Do it. Yeah, this one was broken. Do it the one time. Oh, it was? It was broken? <laughs> right here. Not really. Total juveniles.
Moving to the dorsal valleys. Good morning, Angie. Thank you for watching. Like here with Mary, you can really feel her index extender tendon, her extensor indicus right through here. So when you do that dorsal friction, you almost have to go on one side of that tendon and then the other side of that tendon, kind of pushing it outside, outside a little bit. Same thing, she has some superficial veining through here, so just kind of working around that. Why do you go um, proximally to distally? Because it's easier. Y'all yeah. Yeah. don't even know that, like, I've tried it. <laughs> <laughs> like, I have tried it. I guarantee it. any variation that you can think of, any way that you've thought of to do it, like, I have tried it, and it does not work as well. This is all kind of trial and error by me. Field tested. Field tested, <laughs> totally. Yeah. And, you know, yeah. part of it is like oh, the, the uh, ooh, I'm moving the camera with my butt. Um, <laughs> so the, uh, like, some of the hands that I've seen specifically, they are like really gnarly. And it, these techniques even feel good to, to those people, you know, versus the hand techniques that I was taught, like, some backward stuff, like really backwards, and not fun to receive or give. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Jean, you're hilarious. <laughs> Jean is like literally in the room and she's still she's watching the live feed. Thanks for your support, That's Jean. Commitment, right? That is total commitment. Will not help you learn any faster though. <laughs> Are you sure? Are you sure? If I put it under my pillow while I sleep, that <laughs> help? Sitting behind you, I'm only seeing your back. Now True. I can see what you're doing with your hands. There you go. Well, this will all be available on YouTube. That's how we communicate nowadays. Through our iPhone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> myself on the screen from myself on the screen. It's kind of creepy. <laughs> I'm going to there's one in life here. Can you go? Wow. Hilarious. He's got senioritis, everyone. He does. George, this is George's last weekend. His 12th weekend. Hey. He spent over 192 hours here at the Institute. Easily. Easily. Mm -hmm. And he is now a certified reflexologist after this weekend. Mm -hmm. So he is literally <laughs> playing Candy Crush in the background. <laughs> <laughs> That's his final exam. It's all that homework he had to do last oh my night. God. Those documented sessions are no joke. Get them done, Pagans. Get them done. Yeah. Uh, Flip over to the Palmer surface. Okay, going to the thinner. Get 
we are actually discussing reflexology. Oh no, I I, I know. Those, I hear in you. In case those on on YouTube world can't hear us. <laughs> That's deep trauma. <laughs> ballet lessons. Forced to stand on my toes. Hilarious. Oh, there's some stuff in there. Mm. We're gonna hold that point. We are holding a point. Deviating from the routine. What did you feel? It's um, puffy hardness, so a little bit of fluid, a lot of stiffness. Oh, Waiting, slight pulse, tissues are opening. Waiting for the body to say let go. Yeah, we got some twitches going on. We're good. Okay. One more just for good measure. And then moving on. around. What? I wanted, to watch, I wanted to watch you watch the... Oh, the hypothenar? Yeah. Literally, is like... It, is it along the side, or yeah, just it's, here? Yeah, it's along the side. So you walk here, and mm -hmm. here. Yeah. So that's specifically national hand exam stuff. Okay. They're, they're really specific about knowing the hypothenar. Um, with the with the routine, you're walking on that fifth flexor tendon, fifth digit flexor tendon, and then you're going just lateral to it. Uh, oh, that's... Okay. And it's just, I mean, there's literally nothing there but fluid. But you're not, like, walking still... along the side. No. You're still walking the palmar surface. Yeah. But just that really spongy part. But this is the flexor tendon, and then we're going here. Yeah. Okay. So if someone has carpal tunnel syndrome where their wrist hurts, is mm -hmm. that always associated with reproductive? Not necessarily reproductive, depending on where the wrist actually hurts. Mm -hmm. So you, you'd really want to look at it. You want to feel for, you know, whether or not the bones are hypermobile, whether or not they're stiff, is there mm -hmm. fluid, is there any sign of kind of wart or growth, mm -hmm. you know, things like that. Most of the time when, when clients come to see me for carpal tunnel, we're like halfway through the session and then, you know, the wrist spontaneously like adjusts, mm -hmm. like pop, and they're like, oh, that felt good. And there, it was just a bone that was out of place. Mm -hmm. Okay, back to the relaxation techniques. some movement in the chest. <coughs> Something. Right where we were pressing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See that YouTube land? We're right in the center of the chest reflexes. Now we got our coffin. <coughs> Can I get your water in? Uh, yeah, in my blue uh, case, there's water on the top. Or, I think so, anyway. It feels like some kind of mucus is starting to come up. 
So what area were you working when the cops started? Two and two. Two and two? Chest area. That's <coughs> the point that I held. Okay. So we take a sip of water and then we'll grab the towels. Oh. They are Water not break. hot. Thank you guys are ridiculous. Okay, crunch. I gotta get the towels. <laughs> she's trying to help. She is trying to help, and she's doing a great job. <laughs> Can't have Mary choking out on us. No. We're almost done with the session. No breaking hands, no killing people. Right. Maybe George. Maybe George. We'll okay. consider it. We'll see. Definitely not Mary. We'll consult the family. Nice and circulated. Oh. 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 Fail. Fail. Stop by the roof. It looked pretty though. I could have made it. <laughs> could have hit George square in the nose. I was on it. <laughs> you recruited that beans help long before you. He did. It was a plant. <laughs> Last but not least, taking that final hand, squeezing that heat, unwrapping. Drying with the dry section of that towel. And that is it. Cool. How are you feeling, Mary? Thank you. Good. Thank you. So that was a live demo of the hand reflexology technique over at the Foot Whisperer Reflexology Institute. Stay tuned. Like, share, subscribe to us both on Facebook and YouTube for more videos. And we will see y'all soon.